Hello and welcome back to the Midnight Moose channel. It's time for some more of the Binding of Isaac Repentance. We're back on the Gistum Challenges mod. We're going to play True Judas Challenge today. I guess it's not its own character. It's just like a challenge or whatever. Um, and they're cool, but I don't know. I like the champion characters better. Maybe it's just me. Um, we got Judas's tongue. And the Dark Judas Resurrection. That's why we have a resurrection. I guess it's hidden in the, in the fog. We'll find it later. Hey, there's another book. That's... Cool. Um, let's take it. Soul of Judas is largely, uh, well, you can use it once, of course, but what's the name of that item? The, the dagger? The dagger that Judas does when he's all tainted, like, uh, it's a lot better when you use it a billion times per hour. So, Soul of Judas, it's not useless, but in many ways, it's largely uh, useless. So, there's the sad news there. I guess we could use it and walk through these guys. Do they always get paused completely? Is that real? I think that's fake. Um, either way, we did it. Demon Baby sounds like a great friend to have for Judas. And actually, maybe we should die early on, because then we could just be Dark Judas. Is that allowed? I don't know. Why did I go in the shop? I thought that was the curse room. That's over here. Let's figure it out. Secret room up there. We don't have any bombs. Maybe we do. Okay, there's a bomb. And we're dead. Uh, oh, we have two black hearts. Excellent. We can grab that bomb. And we can, we can get more black hearts in the future using the Satanic Bible, of course. So that'll be good. All right, and we got more bombs. Even better. Maybe we can get a health up pill or tears up or something. That'd be pretty cool. Eh, let's skip that. I, I don't want a good pill or anything like that. That'd be, that'd be sad. Hey, was there anything in here? Dreamcatcher early on would be a lot of health, and we got a penny for it. So that sounds pretty good. And I'm going to keep talking about Dreamcatcher. So, in the next five seconds, I don't skip the cinematic, even though I'd really like to, because I always do. All right, let's see what's in the item room for this floor. Firemind. Okay, that's pretty good. And we fight Rag Man. All right. I mean, I guess it's nice to prepare you for the boss. What are you going to do? Close out of the game if you don't like the boss coming up? I don't really get it. Maybe it's just me. Or maybe they just wanted to justify, you know, the item to do something else. I don't really know. Come on, Demon Baby. We got to go. All right, let's complete this room easily. And then we'll get another black heart of health. But then we have to spend hearts for our boss items. It's all very, you know? I don't really know what a battery in here would be amazing. That's not what we got. And that's okay. We don't need to blow this guy up for extra deal chance or anything. We're on... That's pretty nice. I'll take that any day of the week. Um, we're on, obviously, Burning Basement 2. So our deal is 100% guaranteed to occur. Assuming we don't take red heart... Damage, but we don't have any red hearts, so it's going to be tough to take red heart. Damage. All these poops are paying out really well. I didn't expect them to. We don't even have petrified poop. We have Judas' tongue. Which, now that you mention it, does that even affect soul heart deals? I don't really recall. Maybe they fixed it to do that. I don't know. The poops have nickels. The poops have soul hearts. The fires have soul hearts. I don't know what kind of world we're living in, but I like it for once. We got a bomb. It's pretty cool. Let's go find fire mine. Here it is, eventually. We do have a key, a few of them in fact, so that'll be cool. And we don't have the highest luck, but we could be blowing ourselves up at some point. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Alright, that's not actually the item room, it's the shop. Why did I think it was the item room? Because I'm a fool. Thank you for asking. Alright, over here, what's in this poop? They all got something in them, apparently. Okay, apparently not. Alright then. Uh, item room, though, would be right here. It's a lot of cash. It's a lot of cash. Oh, fire mine. That's a surprise. All right, let's see here. We can get, I like, look at this evil red fiery Judas. That's pretty cool. All right, we'll grab these. I guess we can do this to get 15 cents and then perhaps we'll pop into the shop and maybe get a good 15 cent item. Uh, there's damage ups, there's the clock, there's jar of hearts. What the, what the heck? That's probably not that good, no offense. Um, let's take this and hope it's good. It could be. It could be. We have some cash still. Maybe we could re-roll the devil deal, etc. And there's two more pennies. Isn't that nice? Alright, who are we battling? It's Ragman, obviously. We knew that. It should be a one-hit kill. Firemine shot should be a one-hit kill. The guy's made out of rags. No offense. Uh, they burn due to the fact that... Ouch. Due to the fact that they are cloth. Am I right? Okay, Judas' tongue doesn't work. I'd really like that uh, item, but I can't take it. So, What in God's name is that middle item? I don't know. Let's figure it out later. Where's the hand? I was about to say, is it, is it not coming down? 
So we would have had enough health to take that ocular rift, barely, but then we got hurt. We hurt ourselves. Uh, Self-centered. 25% chance that any new item gets replaced by any of your already owned items. 25% chance. So we could have as many demon babies as we could possibly get. And if it procs once on demon baby, then it's just that much more likely to get more demon babies, even though the one-fourth chance always stays the same. Um, it's interesting. It would kill us as well, I guess, which is a shame. Uh, can we pick up the nail and then use it before we die? I don't think so. I think I tried that too many times before. We only need one more uh, battery charge for a life piece. I don't know. I think we look for, you know, ceremonial robes or something like that. That's an interesting item. What in God's name is this thing? Gula. 2% chance upon killing an enemy to gulp your current trinket. Get a new trinket after the gulping occurred. If you have birthright and you're that character. Which I don't think is this character. They look similar, but I don't know if that's this character. Uh, I mean, this gives us a, a black heart. That'd be good. But we still couldn't take Ocular Rift, so that's sad. But what are we going to get to give us Ocular Rift? Pretty much nothing, so I might as well take this. We can look for something else, though, and then buy... Okay, not those two. Uh, ceremonial... Ro there we go. Okay. We just tripled our health. I'd call that pretty good. And I guess we could look for the pack. Do we want to keep trading our health away for free, quote-unquote? Well, it's unlikely to appear. That's pretty nice. Eye of Belial is pretty nice, too. These are... I don't even know if we should enter another Devil Deal. Because these are some pretty good items, of course. Okay, I guess we could go over here, but we need to earn over one heart to be able to purchase Ocular Rift. Which we could if there's a bunch of chests. There's not a bunch of chests. But now there are. But there's the heart. Okay, we just need a soul. Okay, we've got a soul heart. Let me, let me math this out. It's three hearts. Yeah, we, we'll be fine. And that's why we went in that room for the combat and for the soul heart payout potential. Or we could go in here. What was it? Eye of Belial? Eye of Belial's good. Ocular Rift's pretty good too. I think we'll take Piercing. It's tough. That's a tough... And you get a range up. So, you know, that's when it's good. Okay. We don't have the most health, but we got a book that gives us health. And we stole, like, I don't know, nine hearts worth of items that very floor. We might be okay due to the fact that we have, I don't know, 12 damage on floor three. That's because we're Dark Judas. And we have Piercing, Fiery, Shots. So I'd call that pretty good. I think we got to generate a little bit more health. Oh, yeah, we have the Half Soul Heart from... Uh, oh, yeah, we skipped the... Oh, well. Anyway, sorry, Dreamcatcher. We skipped the video of whatever's in the item room. We have a few keys. We weren't going to skip the item room anyway. Worm Friend's incredible. I'll tell you that much. All right. Worm Friend, thank you. I was about to say, who are you grabbing? We need all the help we can get. There's six worms in this room, and I guess if there weren't... Ouch. If there are worms, and he's Worm Friend, maybe he's friendly to them. I never consider that happening... But yeah, I guess it's possible. Alright, we got another heart. Or we save it and don't get a Devil Deal item. Just kidding, we already used it. So obviously we're not going to save the charge. Might as well explore a little bit. Maybe we get a second black heart this floor. And then maybe we save it next floor to get a real item. Not that we need, you know, damage or anything. But Tears Up would be nice. Tears Up, rather rare in the Devil Deal pool. There's the Pact. I think that's it, actually. So, Tears Up would really be beneficial to get from a boss battle next floor. Assuming that would exist. Assuming we're alive. It's a big assumption. I guess this would be pretty good to do. It's, it's three out of six charges. All we have to do is not blow ourselves up, and we profit rather well. I should try to stand away from the enemies, so I'll do that a little bit. Okay, Worm Friend, great job there. And that guy perished too. This could be the last room, I don't know. It's not. That's good news. Oh, excuse me. Okay, that was tough to do. I think I think Demon Baby did some heavy lifting in that room. I appreciate it, Demon Baby. Another curse room. It could prove useful. This feels like a super secret room. But it's not, in case you were curious. I know I was. All right, we killed that guy very quickly, so I'm happy about that. This pill is going to give us nothing. And this one, okay, gives the damage down. In the form of damage multiplier down. The oh-so-common pill, unfortunately. Alright, where is the regular secret room? It could be above this half heart here. Potentially. Here we go. Alright. Alright, maybe let's get damage multiplier up. Or, or not. Pretty flies, pretty fine. 
So that seems good. I would blow up that guy, but I don't really know if we're going to be spending our hearts in the Devil Deal. Like I already said, we saw all the good items. And we bought half of them, so. Worm Friend basically saves the day in this boss battle. And there you go. Alright, Flight is... Flight is pretty nice. I'm going to have to take that. Okay. What are you going to do? You know, the Devil offers, offers you Flight. I'd buy it. IRL. I mean, it depends on the cost, I guess. It's a pretty important uh, factor in the uh, equation. What are you going to do? Okay, these two... Let's blow this guy up. He might have a nickel inside of him. I know I do. And he didn't, so I guess I ate his nickel. Sorry about that, everybody. And I skipped the, uh, skipped the video once again, I just realized. And we're not going to be getting a boss... Regular boss item this floor, because it's just too good to pass up. And we need all the health we can get. Maybe someday. Maybe on the room one, we won't use it. I don't know. We'll see. Here's a tinted rock. It often involves giving us something cool. Small rock. There's a tears up. I guess we got what we asked for. Thank you, society. Alright, that's a large battery. So we're going to get a regular charge first. Then we can get a black heart for free, basically. At the cost of some walking. Which is okay. Alright. Uh, okay. Alright, well. What are you going to do? All right, two more rooms of combat, and we have our healthy heart coming towards us. Could be these two rooms right here. This one, and of course the item room, it could contain the bulb flies, or whatever they're called, that eat our charges. They don't contain any of that camo undies, so we can break the rainbow poop, and we can break what's their names in the shop using this. So that'll be nice. Why did I go back there? I don't know. I was waiting for the... It was a pre... It was a... I went back too early, basically. Couldn't think of the right word there. Relax. I'm not going to relax. Thanks for asking, though. Just kidding. Of course we will. Uh, and then we'll get this. We'll get a heart. It's pretty nice. By the way, secret room. I didn't even realize it's next to all the cool rooms. So we could see the tears up. That didn't work out. We'll do it, though, because we're ultra-powerful, so it shouldn't be a problem. All right. That guy died. Embarrassing. And hopefully this guy dies, too, eventually. But right now would be best. Your creep can't bother us. We traded part of our soul for flying to the devil himself. You may know him. We just sent you to see him. Thank you. All right, a red heart. I'm going to pass. Juice's tongue does literally nothing, so I guess I'll take the match stick, even though we got plenty of bombs. And this room contains a troll card and temperance reversed. That seems awful. Let's take it. Speed up. That's good. Okay, friends to the end. I can see forever. Range up and relax. Amazing. Well, at least it wasn't five damage multiplier downs. That would have been a rough path. There's a lot of poop in this room. I guess that was me. Sorry about that, everybody. Let's grab some cash. Do we have, like, gulped, invisible, petrified poop or something? Or what? Okay. But again, Judas's shadow makes this quote-unquote challenge. Oh, my God. Okay. I'll take it. Makes this challenge uh, easy-ish, at least. All right. Say hello to this guy. Get some cash here. What do you pay out with a boss item? Potentially some other stuff. Sounds good. I mean, we got all the health we need. Thanks for the damage and range. Buy a map. Why not? There we go. Okay, and we know where we're going. So that's the good news. There's a worm in the floor. But sometimes it's our worm friend in the floor. So that's good to have somebody on our side. We have uh, I Can See Forever. So I imagine... There we go. All right, what's in here? Excellent. Um, I guess we can do two of these and see what happens. And just get our heart back. Nothing happened. Excellent. All right, who are we battling? It seems to be the Fallen. And he seems to have fallen, and he can't get up. Just kidding. All right, is Azel's Rage? I probably passed on that. Um, let's see here. I mean, more damage is nice. More flying is nice, I guess. Well, we got plenty of each. But we do have a Soul Heart for free. So I guess we'll take this and then replenish, you know, one third of the cost immediately. And why not take this? Even though I said we wouldn't. We're just doing that well. Alright, where are we? By the, and I skipped the thing, sorry about that. Necropolis 1, Curse of the Blind. So the cinematic really would have helped out there. I'll tell you that much. Really would have helped us uh, not take Cursed Eye or something like that. I don't really know what's on the... Excuse me. I don't really know what's available in the item room right now. But I would have if I had any patience, but I don't, sadly. 
Alright, we got a bomb that's super nice. These guys are all dead. Oh, thanks. An L room. Golden bomb. Worm friend helping everybody succeed. Everybody that is, uh, me, that is. We could hold off here and hope for tears up from the boss. Is that a small item room down there? Or what do you think? I forgot about that item. Uh, it's not a small item room. It's a small curse room. I'm going to have to think about that. Let's go in there. It's only half of a heart. And we got some friends. And we got a permanent friend. Till the end of the run. Which is, of course, Blue Baby on this challenge mode. Do we kill everybody? Okay, cool. We don't know what it is, but it's Bursting Sack. It's bursting with spider love. So I think that's beautiful. Uh, we have 12 cents, and we don't want to spend any money, so I probably won't. 10 cents is a space bar item anyway. We might want to save our book for some time. Or not. I'd be happy to trade it for something just powerful. The straw. That's about it. Um, Anzus, well, that would tell us about secret rooms and stuff. But we have a golden bomb, and this guy's good as dead. There he goes. Let me get some cash, aka a damage up. Where's a regular secret room? Could be not here, in case you're curious. Um, ouch. Let's see here. It could be here, I suppose. Alright then. Oh, there's Cursed Eye, I assume. Oh, and we killed that individual. That was a pure accident. Raw liver. Hey, that's pretty nice. Makes us up for not using the book. Makes up for us not using the book. Maybe the better way to phrase that. Do we have a Sazel's Rage? Hey, there we go. Never mind. Um, tears up. Okay, well that was... We avoided using the HP up so we could get an HP up. There you go. Alright. Can we get your lump of coal, please? It's just before Christmas. I would love a lump of coal. Thank you. Alright, I guess we'll use this here and see how it goes. Not that we're going to get any boss item reward on the mom fight. Well, I guess we do, but oh, there was the item room door. I, I only watched it once. Literally two seconds after buying the item. Otherwise, nope. Anyway, uh, I guess mom does give us an item, but it's pretty much, you know, a choice of the same two items every time, and the Bible of Satanism doesn't affect the choice. So, yeah. Okay, let's blow up these things sooner or later. And there they go. Okay, we got a bomb. We got a full, healthy amount of black hearts. This might be where the boss is, actually, now that I look at the map. And we didn't use our Anzus thing either. Okay, is this... Uh, let's use this. We know where the super secret room is. It's right here. If possible, we could... That's going to hurt. If possible, we could locate the full skull. That'd be fun. We have way le more bombs than we have keys, so I think blowing up into the item room sounds smart. Actually, we don't even have to do that. We just had to go into the secret room, and greed opened up into the item room. I appreciate it. That's useless in many ways. Sorry, little chat. It's just the truth. All right, we don't want the tick either. Piggy bank. I mean, it costs money now, but if we get hurt a lot, we'll get damage up over time. I don't think we're going to get hurt that much. No offense, everybody. There's the full skull, so that's good. Could steal an item. Could go into the arcade. I was, I was hoping for, you know, a per throw or something like that. Maybe a D6 is in boss rush. It's happened before. I assume... Go through here. All right, Red Mom, scary stuff. Worm Friend can't hold on to the eyeball. Not many people can, so I can't really. I'm not faulting Worm Friend. I'm just updating you on the situation, in case you were curious. All right, we're not getting a lot of fire mine explosions. So that's good, except now that I've said it, I'm sure we will get exploded. It's a shame. Okay, there we go. Maybe one more stomp. All right, then we have to go to Blue Baby. Allegedly, we have some time. We can check this out. God's name is this? Suburbia. Plus five bombs. Super troll bombs are now friendly and won't damage you. They gain the effect of your other bomb items, which is none. And 50% upon 50 chance upon placing a bomb for it to be replaced by a friendly troll bomb. I don't get the benefit of that. 100% uh, chance for this guy. I don't know. I, he was not that guy, I don't think. Whatever. I guess we'll buy it. Right? And then we'll buy this as well for nice Leviathan up. 
one of these. Check this out. What do we got? D10, the poop, bag of crafting, and infestation. What in God's name did I do to deserve this? I guess we'll take infestation as it is a passive item. I'd replace the book with something good, but you saw what items were there. All right, I guess we'll check this out. Oh, what? They're like rainbows. Fifty percent chance to be um, okay. I don't really understand. Maybe the rainbows have like a rainbow effect. Did I miss that in the reading of the item? I don't know. All right, let's hop down here. We don't want to spend any cash. All right, we're ready to go to the womb. And we don't have to use the book as our health is rather high. Oh yeah, I guess we'll take this. What happens if you hit the chest and you don't have the... I guess you just end the challenge without completing it. I guess. If that matters, I don't know. Alright. Let's find every enemy on the floor here. It should be pretty simple. Our... Okay. Our tears feel awful. Like the tear rate. I don't know why. I know it has increased in some time. But, you know, I really don't know. Alright, there's some health that we don't even need. We didn't watch the thing, but it doesn't really matter too much this floor. And at least I can say that as a truth. It's not an excuse, because I wouldn't have watched it anyway, as you noticed. But it is the truth. Okay, let's get this guy out of here. Thank you, worm friend. Could use that and then heal ourselves back up. I'm not going to do that. Obviously, the boss is somewhere up here, perhaps. Not sure how I avoided getting hit there, but okay. Not a secret room, in case you were curious. Actually, now that you mentioned it, I guess I should have known that, because the room with the pill, blah, 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 etc. You know how it goes. All right, what's over here? Okay. Yeah, sure. We got plenty of bombs, and they're all rainbows, partially, from here on out. Death car, that could come in handy. Not really against Mama Gertie. I mean, it deals 40 damage, but there's only one of her. You want to use it in a room where there's at least two enemies. Uh, that's what I would say, anyway. An HP up. I'm really glad we didn't use the book. So we didn't get a good item. We got dinner instead. Okay. All right then. Well, I guess we could check this out. Okay, let's do it, right? Then we get our health back. And a bit of a damage up from the cash. Then we get hit. No, we still had Polaroid invincibility perhaps? I don't really know. We are camouflaged, so I don't really know anything these days. All right, my guess is we're going to battle It Lives. Probably down on the left. Right, we'll check it out. What's our Azazel counter out? Probably next room, Azazel uh, Rage. That's my best guess, anyway. Ansys? Wow, I, I, I had no idea where the boss was, apparently. All right, let's check out the secret room. It's a big secret. Okay, it's a big amount of cash, aka damage up. And we can't go into the boss trap room. Thanks a lot for that. Really glad we had Azazel's rage for that room. Otherwise, I wasn't really sure if we were going to do it at all. Could have ended the whole run. I wish I was kidding. All right. Well, those are friendly. Again, though, I don't know what they do, but that's fine. Um, what's up here? Christmas catalog. Well, we don't have any more shops, so I can't take it with us as much as I'd like to. All right, eyes, we use death card, right? It lives, we use spells against it, aka tears, I don't know why I call them spells. All right, I've been playing too much game with spells in it. Uh, here we go. Demon baby, you wanna do anything? Thanks a lot, appreciate it. Hey, devil deals. Yikes, hey, at least we got a black heart back. Pretty fly, it would be our third pretty fly. Sounds pretty good to me, all right. We got three orbitals, we got one demon baby. And we're gonna go fight Isaac. He's already crying in our dream, so that's how you know we're gonna do pretty well. My guess is he's all the way down there at the bottom. We'll see how it goes. What do we have? Oh, we have mysterious liquid for uh, modeling clay. That's pretty nice. And now we have nothing for modeling clay. That's how it rolls, unfortunately. Can clay roll? Yeah, I guess you just have to shape it into a ball sphere or something like that okay this seems good everybody loves tiny planet good thing we had Azazel's rage all right 
we can heal ourselves here. But we don't have to just yet, so we won't. Not sure I, why I walked into those. I guess I knew I could heal myself. And then I did. Alright, Proptosis. Yikes, but at least we have Azazel's Rage. And there's Isaac. Okay, what do we have? Nothing. We just have modeling clay. We've exploded one way or another. I guess not with bombs, as those don't hurt us. Okay, did it make... It didn't poison Isaac? I don't know. I mean, I like the graphic of the rainbow bomb. I just don't understand what it does. Apparently nothing. That's fine. Or whatever. Okay. Worm friend, you hold him there. I'm gonna shoot the tears. Good job. Alright, let's hide between the... There we go. Here's Isaac. Demon baby's doing something for once. It's a surprise of a lifetime. And there he goes. Alright, let's grab that soul heart so we can repair our health pool. And then simply hop in here. Alright, we have to defeat the chest using Dark Judas. He's only got 12 hearts, 20 damage, and... And Tech X. Um, Juicy Sack's always good. Not sure about these others. I'll be honest. I guess this is pretty good with the shot speed down and Tech X, right? It's going to take forever to charge. Look at that. Look at that face. You look like a microwave. An angry microwave. Alright. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good uh, <clears throat> combo. Alright, we're going to get these dips out of here. Red Heart, no thanks. Those bombs are only friendly to me, pal. So, thanks for making a friend. Spawns one extra bomb. I guess that'd be good. For our bomb-related items. But, we're doing fine. We're not really placing bombs offensively. Right? Okay, here we go with this. No problem there. Some skeletons. Easily defeated by reducing their life points to zero. 20 seconds after we shot that technology shot. Pretty good. Here's a tiny room. Those are always fun. And we got a key. That could prove nice. Uh, we only have two keys, but I guess, you know, we're not going to be needing that many. As we don't have a bunch of luck. And there's like four rooms left in the whole run. Unless we get the Delirium Portal. I feel like we could probably kill Delirium with this, I don't know, character and item set that we got. This loadout of items. And three keys. Okay, we just increased our keys by 50%, and we didn't even get to... Use a regular, t and there it goes. Okay, well, there's the challenge. That's true. Judas, a.k.a. die and become dark Judas immediately. That was easy, but that'll do it. Leave a like if you enjoyed this challenge. Subscribe if you want to see more Isaac every day. And thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Take care of yourself. Farewell, and of course, goodbye.